we want to read here the word. Okay. He that heareth the word. That's it. And understand it. That's a new. Understand it. Because there is a lot of folk that leave churches not understand. And when you don't get to understand it, you cut your blessing off. Hmm? Mm -hmm. okay. You cut your blessing off. Mm -hmm. Notice when you hear the word, hear the word, understand the word, and this good ground, what this word is planted into, this good ground produces some, some yep. a good harvest. Yes, yes. All right now. This good ground people, the one that hear the word, understand the word, they bring forth a harvest yes. to themselves and to the church. But we need people who can come into the church and, and be on fire. <laughs> Glory to God. On so much fire. They, they, they go past them. Amen. Hey, you know, that, you know, that's come in church with the fire. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Woo, oh, thank you. Oh, 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 oh. I, I used to see folk jump out the car, running, getting in the church. Yes. Yeah, they right, oh, hell cool. Amen. They excited, boy. You, you better not get in the way they try to get in the church. <laughs> you get, they set that big pocketbook down. <laughs> and, and before you know, they already done got up. And, oh! oh hallelujah. They didn't have to be pumped up. They already had what they Cause see, they spend time, amen, in God. They spend time fasting. They play time head and the head, the voice of God. And you, I tell you this, but I'm excited. But you, I tell you this, but as you study your word and the spirit in you, the voice will start speaking. Anybody the spirit or something like that? Amen. 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 When you study that word, Amen. when you study that word with a good, pure heart, and you want something out of that oh, word, yes. go to God. I guarantee you the, the voice of God will start speaking Ooh. unto you. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And that's why that word in there is mentioned in that word called mystery. Reveal the secret unto you. Right. Well, you will know the inner part of that scripture. You, well, you will hear the voice of God. You will know the heart of God. Mm -hmm. ha, oh, God, don't get me excited. Oh, mm. Mm -hmm. oh, mm -hmm. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Which also bears fruit mm -hmm. and bringeth forth some a hundredfold, some sixty, some thirty. That's the result of when you train yourself to hear. When you want to understand, glory to God, this is what happened to the good crowd folk that come into church. And when they go home, they're still good crowd. You understand what I'm saying? Because we got folk good crowd in church, but when they get home, they, 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 they thorns, wayside. Because, see, good ground, not only good ground in the sanctuary, but they are good ground outside, outside the church. Yeah. You know, I always get an example, they are good ground at Burger King. You went by the little few box there, and, they, they, and you said, uh, uh, I, I want me a, 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 a big whopper, but hold the mayonnaise. And when you got to the weather, the mayonnaise falling all out your bar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and you finna show off now. Mm -hmm. uh -uh, that, 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 you don't hear it because, see, God, I've been talking to you for you got right there. <laughs> no, you ain't, you ain't, uh -uh, that don't go. <laughs> do, do, y'all help me out. Can that be a sake of God and the woman out in it, in the one that burned him? Because they born and got ran over Betty. See, I don't see any some sense. The 
Yeah, cool. Yeah, it's all, because see, the Bible deals with us in kind when you look at your book of Ephesians. It talks about kind. And that we rule, crew, and, 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 and talk about the Holy Ghost, that don't work. The Pope Mormon mind didn't hear you right. You should have some sort of patience, some kind of compassion. As you was in that one and didn't hear right, and you, you squeezed out a bunch of bad day on the bar, you want compassion for you. But now you is the one that receiving the burger. Now you finna go off in the one that front of everybody. And then start speaking in tongue when you get back to church. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of stuff is that? Train them is to hear. Glory to God. Okay, okay. Now I had to go to Ever Thank you. Come on, sir. You said uh that we were and in my situation, I work with you. So I have to have a firm category with my children in order for them. Because when I go in there, pray every morning, Lord, give me strength to deal with these children. Okay, when I go in there and I try to be nice and pleasant and do all the things that I'm supposed to do as far as niceness. But these children don't hear that. These children today got a different kind of category, and I don't understand how they're being raised. Because you can say, little Johnny, please sit down. He'll tell you what he's not going to do and how he's going to do. Mm -hmm. So then I got to get firm. I got to get firm. Look now, little boy, you going to do what I say. <laughs> you know, you just, gotta, you just gotta put it down like that. And so then I said to myself, Lord, Am I being too mean or am I being, I mean, I actually have to be like a prison guard sometimes. Uh -huh. and, 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 and I just say, Lord, give me strength. So maybe y'all can tell me something. Okay. Um, I, I'm like a little, a little, um, what would you, a prison guard sometimes. I just have to lay it on the line. Look, you going to do what I say or else. Uh -huh. I mean, play right out me. And I don't want to be mean, but that's part of my job, to make yeah. them do what I say do. Mm -hmm. So, y'all maybe could help me, because um, I don't know. Okay, another comment, come on. I see y'all smiling. This is a good discussion. We might be here while on this. Come on. Let's see. I've got the kids. I've got the kids, too. But I pray in the classroom on the kids get the mm -hmm. And then... I asked the Lord, I said, now, you work on those children. I said, give me the right word here yes. to that child. Yeah. I said, dear Lord, I said, now, I'm going to find that devil in that child before he even get here. Mm -hmm. And so, I don't have no problem. I got a desk. I have to tell him, go back to the seat. Mm -hmm. I said, I'm not the teacher. I said, I'm a boss of mm -hmm. I said, when you get out of order, I put them aside. Mm -hmm. And I tell them, I said, it's the best order to do, do the right thing. I said, it's just as good for you to do the right way as it is for you to do the wrong way. Mm -hmm. I said, then you got that. I said, but now, this here between me and you, I said, you have a, a problem. It got to be there for you. I said, now you going to go back to your seat and do what Miss Philip tell you to do, or I'm going to have a train going up that hole, going to the principal office. I said, then you're going to get a pack. Mm -hmm. I said, now which one you want to do? They go right to their seat now like a child. Amen. Because here's a way way to do it. Here's a way you can speak to yeah. the child. And they'll love you to death. Mm -hmm. Oh, they all love me. They say I'm nice, but I don't see how. <laughs> a lot of them say I'm mean, but I'm fair. <coughs> so <laughs> I must be doing something right. <laughs> okay, Ella Cooper, come on. You 